All right, Rooney Kenshin, episode three. Remember to check out that Patreon for the early and uncut versions of everything on the channel. And please leave a like on the video because it does boost the channel. Let's hop right into today's episode. Let's do it. Ito Kiri Gasuke. Yeah, why would that okay you're crazy for that one you're about to die but why would i want to stay here and be your henchman forever Right in the nuts. Damn, man. I love the way they're animating this right now. I respect it. He was really about to kill him, took the blade out and everything. Here's that man Kenshin. What a beautiful entrance. Take a short nap. You're lucky it's not a long nap. If you wanted to, it would be very long. Wow. Talk about intimidation. We didn't even have to deal with all of them. I just assumed he would have to. That is. He'd he does have his pride like come on buddy though i you gotta admit yeah can't just like come on Kenshin's such a good guy he knows Ooh, he's seen those eyes before not just a yak but a, a real one they call him a real hitokiri batosai <laughs> the way he said that was hard he's like if he only wants the kid and is willing to go more than fair that's a great deal on my part that just goes to show how badass kenshin is mm. that's the only thing he can protect is their legacy their honor that's the stick he was training with earlier he's gonna be our first student I would love that. I'm home that I am. That's what I'm saying. Well, you needed a student and he needs training. I'll just call her an old hag. I think she's very pretty. Yeah. The rest is up to you. <laughs> those are like the ba bamboo training swords right come on you have to be able to get trained that they do Mm. They all came there for uh, Kenshin versus really Kaoru. Don't worry, Kaoru. Word of you will spread as well. Don't worry. Bro, we need dedication. That it is. Yeah. I need to know his backstory on where he learned it. I want to know his master. I want to know everything. Please! 
Jesus, they really cannot get along. He's being a little mean right now. Ira and Sato. Oh, oh, you're gonna come on to my land and refuse to answer some questions? No, no types, Missy. And Yahiko can recognize a little bit of strength now from her. This seems like it would go beyond a drunken group of friends, you know. I'm a little curious. Did they just do the right thing, or are they in the wrong? Maybe they are in the right. This guy looks like an asshole. <laughs> Yahiko is a blunt guy. Maybe they were the drunkards. Mm. That sounds about right. It's a very perceptive young boy, Yahiko. She just defended her honor standing up for you when you guys are in the wrong, you know? Damn, a wooden cannon. A broken arm, huh? Sounds familiar. Damn. Yeah, now she's involved. But that's where you cross the line. He's a real one. Wow. That is most definitely some taking responsibility. Hell no. <laughs> he has the most pride of any little kid I've ever seen. Mm. And now he's back. That you shouldn't. They know. Name starting to word starting to spread. Oh, the talk of the town. You know how easily he could fucking fuck up that wooden cannon. All right, Zoro, chill out. Yes, I know he did this before Zoro. I just got a fucking I, come on, man. He did it with oh, anything other than humans. He will use that back dangerous blade, and if you're not human, those are the same eyes that what's his name was talking about. I love that shit. Damn, you've brought shame and dishonor. You're a real one, Yahiko. Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna take a little getting used to. He's like Toph from Avatar The Last Airbender, you know? A little bit of sandpaper on the outside, a little rough around the edges, but I like him a lot. I really like Kaoru and I really like Kenshin as well. So far, the team looking real good. I know we know. I know we have that one other guy from the opening. I'm very excited. As no masters, acting master Kaoru Kamiya, student Yahiko Myojin, and Rooney Kenshin Imura. One day in early spring on the 11th year, and a small new step was definitely taking. I love that with the two practice sword and then Kenshin's. Man, these episodes are so good. I'm really liking the show. It looks like we have an after credit scene. Who is this guy? Who is this guy now? 
Is he the other guy from the opening? Are there any good? Come on! Oh, gets me excited for next week. Great episode. I love Kenshin saving uh, Yahiko from the Yakuza. I love the Yakuza referencing him, uh, uh, Himura from like the Meiji area, the Bakamatsu, all that. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, you guys are giving me historical data for this time, and I need to go through it methodically and actually study the period that we're in because. I know very little about Japanese feudalism, and I would love to know more just in terms of a historical standpoint, but it would help me so much with this. So I know you guys are giving me that info. Continue to give me that info, and I will try to absorb it as best I can. Thoroughly enjoying this. Really enjoy Yahiko as a character. Kaoru, I'm loving her. Uh, and then Kenshin's that fucking boy. So hopefully you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to check out the Patreon for early access and full length. Uh, tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. I appreciate y'all.